Hello YouTube, this is Total 2. Yeah, returning for another free start and a model review. Yeah, today I'll be reviewing this Spinosaurus modeled mud by Slike. Yeah, uh, this is uh, uh, this is a model I am very excited of getting. Uh, Spinosaurus is actually one of my favorite carnivorous dinosaurs, especially after uh, Jurassic Park 3. Yeah. And 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 the and the color scheme that uh, uh, select side of painting uh, does resemble uh, Spinosaurus' appearance in, uh, in Jurassic Park. Now, Spinosaurus lived during the early Cretaceous period, it, and the reason why is now Africa, or in Af uh, now Egypt. Yeah, uh, ex uh, back in the dinosaur time, Egypt what uh, what. Uh, was a lush, uh, wetland, uh, once swamped, uh, much like the, uh, uh, uh the, the estuaries in, uh, of Australia today. And it, mm. Yeah, and this animal is uniquely designed, uh, was, was perfectly designed to li to live in a, in a swampy habitat. It is nice and slender. Spinosaurus was actually one of the was the longest uh, carnivorous dinosaur uh, ever to walk the earth. Yeah, uh, full, fuller grown Spinosaurus has been known to uh, grow up to fifty feet long, from the uh, from a crocodile snout to an its long, uh, long tail. Yeah, compare compare that to Tyrannosaurus rex. Now, which was 45 feet long, its tail is rose five feet longer. No, but no, but not the largest as uh, as Tyrannosaurus Rex was six times heavier. No, weighed six tons compared to a Spinosaurus weighed only four tons. And of course, a much larger dinosaur, or Dachanosaur, from South America, uh, weighed a uh, whopping uh, eight tons. So it, it, it was not, uh, so it was not the largest. So the movie is basically from you know, lie to you. Yeah, Spinosaurus is probably the the third uh, third largest you know, carnivorous dinosaur ever lived you know, by weight. However, however, if you go by size, and yes, yeah, Spinosaurus, it, 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 it is the largest. It's easily, uh, easily longer than uh, Tyrannosaurus uh, Rex and Juggernautosaurus, but uh, to me, uh, not by weight. Yeah, that's uh, that's what uh, that's what I judge to be a uh, being the uh, uh, the largest animals by weight, not by size, because sometimes size. Can't get uh, exaggerated. Well, uh, well, that's just, well, not this predator. This you know, this was the largest car carnivore in in, uh, in Africa, the most powerful predator. However, th th this animal mo mostly preyed uh, uh, on fish. It uh, uh, spent a lot. Of, uh, uh, that, yeah, you uh, using his long uh, using his long forearms. Actually, the long uh, actually recently discovered that Spinosaurus had really long arms, the longest uh, 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 the longest of any other uh, carnivore. Uh, yeah, that that includes you know, all the bit uh, all, all the big carnivores like Tyrannosaurus Rex hmm, and Allosaurus, and and and, and his claws. Yeah, there are uh, tiny claws that's not uh, designed to hook up fish. Uh, perhaps, uh, perhaps it will hunt similar to uh, a grizzly bear. What it's all it's see and what uh, because this animal, uh, this animal could uh, actually had a good sense of smell. I could actually see smell through underwater. So, uh, so when it sees a, a passing fish, going, uh, smells a passing fish going by, uh, and also spot for this ice, keen eyesight, uh, they can uh, they can uh, shoot those arms, grab the fish, and uh, pull them, and use these croc uh, tail to tear uh, tear the head off 
and uh, swallow the fish whole. <sighs> no, but about to do it, about to do it this huge size. Uh, 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 all those animal fish could not be could not be the only thing it's after. Yeah, so mo most likely this animal would also be after uh, crocodiles. Uh, because this animal is not nice and slim, you know, because I envision this animal will be like a big cat, like a tiger. Because it's lo it's long uh, crocodile-like snout, even though it looks like it's actually it's actually uh, much fragile. It, it, if it if it tries to bite through a bone, the jaws will break. So per uh, perhaps it, uh, this killer te has a te killer technique similar to big cats. Uh, like tigers, leopards. Hmm. Where, uh, where they, 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 they strangle the prey, or, uh, or just get, uh, get in their teeth to puncture their, their, their throats. Contrary to the belief that, uh, leopards do, uh, leopards do not, uh, actually strangle their prey. They actually get, uh, they actually get the teeth into the prey, into the, into the windpipe, and then they'll and they'll squeeze just enough uh, to mm, get their ca get their canines to puncture you know, the windpipe, you know, w which then the prey, the prey will die uh, die instantly. <sighs> yeah. So uh, so yeah. Really, uh, really, you don't need a huge jaw. So this is uh, so because it's not it's not nearly as heavy as I uh, as Tyrannosaurus Rex. Probably it's not built to be like a uh, a predator built on pure power. Yeah, actually, it, it is much more uh, a much uh, much faster, more agile predator that that could perhaps perhaps use stealth uh, to pounce its prey. Much like a, much like a leopard, but a wood. I guess, I guess it's, uh, it's, it's odd shape. It's beautifully designed to, you know, break up its uh, outline. Yeah, so it can stay. Uh, so he can stay hidden am among the forest, right, ready to ambush any animal that passes by, even a dinosaur or even a crocodile. Uh, and, uh, yeah, he'll uh, you know what? Uh, he'll quickly, uh, he'll quickly pounce on it. Yeah, you know, pin it, uh, pin it down uh, with his large forearms. Then gets his, get then gets his teeth, you know, into the into the windpipe to, you know, puncture it. Yeah, uh. uh uh, and Spinosaurus instantly gets his meal. Yeah, and, th and this uh, uh, really, uh, th uh, really, this uh, uh, this animal, I picture as a uh, as a uh, super aggressive predator. As you can see, it has a, ver a very long uh, spine, uh, uh, long sail on its back, which gives uh, Spinosaurus his name. Oh, sp uh, spiny reptile. Yeah, but uh, but uh, yeah, many, many, many paleontologists yeah uh, often puzzle what the sail is used for. Could be you know, regulated by t by temperature, much like the sail of uh, Dimetrodon. Yeah, but being but since dinosaurs being a warm-blooded animal. Yeah, perhaps is not uh perhaps is not used by that. Others could use a splay. Yeah. Uh, uh, I think it is my is my uh, might have to do with this armor. Yeah, because uh, the shield is actually made out of bone. Yeah, so uh so let's uh yeah, so this animal, uh, so this you know, sail acted like a shield. So when, uh, so when they get another fight, or uh, two spy stars get into a fight, yeah, that, mm, yeah, when when the uh, when the rival gets starts lunging, trying uh, trying to bite the animal, yeah, 
Yeah, the, uh, the other Spinosaurus will quick, uh, quickly get its sail uh, toward, uh, no, toward the, mm, the predator's bite. It will bite the sail instead. Yeah, because, because of the Spinosaurus jaws aren't strong enough to break bone, this, this shield is perfect for it. Of course, if, of course, if a, if a bone does break uh, on a sail, it really doesn't do, not, not do the animal. It, it is not really a big deal to this animal. Much rather have the, uh, the bones up here get uh, get broken rather than having like uh, the arms or even the throat get uh, get bitten off and cause serious injury. So, uh, so this is uh, so that's probably what the purpose of the sail was. Yeah, what uh, similar to the the scaly armor of a crocodile. Yeah, that's that's used to protect bites from its own kind, ca- own kind. Perhaps uh, bites from other uh, carnivorous dinosaurs that uh, that, uh, that competes with in its environment. Uh, so, uh, so yeah, that's uh, pretty much it for uh, for the uh, for the animal. Let's talk, let's talk about the model itself because really the model is really a fantastic sculpt. I mean, I mean, you can see a, a, a real live animal. As you can see, it's not it, it doesn't ha- it's not a kind of kneeling down on all fours. It, it's pr- perhaps a pose of this animal actually. Going to the water, catching, yeah, you know, catching fish. <laughs> yeah, but that's a that's an alright pose. I just wish it would probably would probably because of the sail would have trouble, you know, balancing this figure. Probably the reason why they had to do it, do it this way. But uh, but but, uh, but other than that, this is this is a very nice sculpt. Very, uh, they, uh, nice detailed job on, uh, on this, uh, on the reptilian skin, all the way down to his tip. And that e- even the sail itself, you can see some. Yeah, you can. Yeah, you can clearly see the spines underneath, uh, and some texture of the skin. Yeah, uh, which I uh, which I imagine is uh, the skin right here. Yeah, uh, what uh, would have been thick high to further protect uh, protect this animal from attacks from uh, from another Spinosaurus. And over here, and, and over here, you got uh, you got the nice view of the head, and like all the. Uh, like all the therp- all the carnivorous dinosaurs, from like, yeah, it, ha- it has a jaw, uh, it has a hinge on his jaw, so you can mo- uh, have an option to open and close, which is very neat. Yeah, and the de- and really the detail of this figure is absolutely fantastic, and actually get a a better uh, a great detail of. Uh, of its eye, almost like a crocodile-like eye, yeah, rather than bird-like, uh, 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 like Allosaurus had. Yeah, also a nice detail of his uh, jaw muscles. This animal must have a very good bite force, and you can make out its uh, hearing. Yeah, it's, it's ear hole right here. I just wish uh, Slyke uh, painted all. Is that way you could see him better? Yeah, for some, some reason they, ne- they never paint the ear, uh, uh, the, uh, the ear holes uh, of the dinosaurs. Yeah, and over you can see, uh, yeah, over you can see its, uh, its nostrils and also a little mu- mucus coming out, which... No, which a lot, uh, which help, uh, which helps gives uh, this dinosaur a good sense of smell. Uh, the uh, mucus keep, uh, keeps uh, no uh, stuff like pollen away from the right, uh, from clogging the nostrils. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You see the, yeah, you do the see the same thing of many predators like 
It's not just your pet dog or, or you know, or even a wolf or a bear. Also, ha it has that technique. Yeah, and also most, most surprising and the best detail are, are the we making the teeth. I mean, they're not just white. They also, also some look worn out. Nah, those you know, yeah, uh, di uh, dinosaurs. Uh, uh, dinosaurs are like uh, are like croc are like crocodiles. Uh, when uh, when they yeah when they when these sharp teeth uh, get worn out, yeah then uh, then uh, then they'll start to fall uh, fall out, and you got and I got these little you know, teeth right here that are, that are starting to grow to, uh, to replace it. You know, so eventually these teeth will be as long. As a teeth on the back, so this is really gives it a might get uh, might give an illusion of Spinosaurus having like a you know a fish like jaw due to the shape of his teeth because you know di you know dinosaur carnivorous dinosaurs lo lose their teeth uh, uh, in their lives and cause they regrow them. So this could could give so this could give an illusion. Uh, uh, well, uh, so I probably had, uh, had no idea what these animals' jaws you know, really looked like. Yeah, and also same thing. You got and also same thing. With the lower teeth. You can see, uh, see uh, pure white teeth. Also, some teeth are worn out right here. Some te teeth are about to about to get lost. Yeah, very, uh, very nicely done. No, uh, for uh, for a living car a dinosaur, and yeah, uh, and if you look in, yeah, uh, on the roof and of a mountain, you can also see some nice detail. Mm. No, the uh, uh, detail ribs out the up, uh, upper jaw. I don't know what they call those. You know, nice detail of, uh, of the tongue itself. Yeah. Hmm. Uh, uh. And uh, and if you look at look at, look at the neck and any size detail sculpt up you know, of the scales, it goes right belly and uh, and also if you look closely on the sides, right here, looks like something uh, looks like this animal might have some scars. Yeah, some some black spots of, of, of the scales. Yeah, uh, could admit, uh Oh, uh, could actually be like scars, yeah, from a pre previous fight. Uh, same, uh, same thing with the tail. Yes, yeah, see, uh, see same thing there. Yeah, many many carnivorous dinosaurs like this that had uh, savage lives. So the uh, so they uh, so the B uh, uh, or the B one you have to be tough, and yeah, they probably these dinosaurs probably were. And, uh, and if you look on their belly, of course, you, uh, of course you see the name Spinosaurus, in case you don't know what it is. And ni a nice detail uh, uh, of the legs right there. Yeah, and also, uh, yeah, and also nice detail on the feet. Nice, nice bird-like feet, uh, uh, typical of all dinosaurs. Yeah, so yeah, this is a very, uh, this is a very nicely sculpt. Uh, this is a very, very nicely done figure, and best of all, he's in perfect in scale. Uh, if you compare, it, uh, if you compare it to like the Allosaurus, which is a much smaller dinosaur. Yeah, it, mm, yeah, Spin uh, Spinosaurus actually beats it uh, both in height and length. And, and this and this is not, not staying up on its proper two two leg stance. Yeah, so yeah, so this is a very uh, not only is a nicely sculpted figure, it's also a good scale with the other carnivorous dinosaurs. No, both of them I liked. Yeah, I, I appreciate. So yeah. If you look, uh, if you if you want a good Spinosaurus figure, uh, a model to, to have on yourself, this is a great. No, this is a great figure to have.
No, best, uh, best of all. Uh, if you have, like... Uh, for Jurassic Park fans, if you do have, like... Uh, figures from your Human Alliance figures. Spinosaurus scale uh, works perfect. This is actually how, how big this animal was uh, in real life. But yeah, he could also yeah fit uh, fit him in his jaw like he's gonna eat him. So yeah, fit, uh, so yeah, so you do have options for that. So even uh, so uh, wherever you're cl uh, collecting dinosaur models for you know for pre for science reasons or for movie or re or because you're fat fan of the movies, this is a great this is a great fan this is a great. Uh, the Spinosaurus I have. Yeah, and that's pretty much it for my video review on this. No. Uh, uh, on this Spinosaurus model. If you like this video, please throw in the description. Thank you for watching.